Hey everyone, Miss Ashley here, and today we are going to draw Groot. Okay, let's get started. First, we are going to start with Groot's eyes. And he has two kind of big round eyes, and we're going to start close to the top of our paper. And inside each circle, we're going to draw a smaller circle. Those are going to be like the highlights of his eyes. And the same on the other side. Awesome. Okay, next we're going to draw his face. So he has kind of like a U-shaped face. So we're going to start up here above his eye and draw a big U and back up. And it's okay if your lines are not straight because that will actually make it look like, you know, bark to a tree. All right, now let's do his hair. Um, so you're gonna come up and do little line across and down. They almost look like little rectangle shapes. And over and down. And it's okay if your lines are not straight. That helps make him look more realistic. And then we'll draw just a few lines off of these and that makes it look like little cracks in the wood. All right. Next, let's draw his body. Um, I'm gonna start right here. And it's a little bit of a curved line kind of for his neck and then a straight line down. And same on the other side. Curve in just a little bit and then a straight line down. And he has two like block feet. So draw a line across and go to the other side of his body and across, but don't let those two lines touch. Now we're gonna draw a V. So start on this leg and go up about there and back down and those will be his two legs and let's draw a line here this kind of makes another v and this will separate his legs from his body and we'll fill that in more later okay and let's give him some arms i'm going to start on the right side and my first arm is gonna be kind of a little wiggly. It's like an S shape, like that. But you can do his arms however you'd like. You can do them straight or facing up. And let's connect them and close it. Okay, and now let's do the other arm. And I'm gonna face this one kind of up like he's waving. And there we go. All right, now let's give him some details. Let's go back up and give him a little mouth. And we can go back into his arms and draw just little lines. They can go in any direction it looks best if they're connected, kind of like a puzzle piece. And this will make him look like he's got bark. And let's draw some lines on his body. 
And these don't have to be straight, they don't have to be perfect. However you would like them to go. some lines on his legs. I'm going to give him little lines at the bottom, kind of like toes. Cool. Alright, now Groot has some leaves that are growing off of him. So let's go, I'm going to the top of his head and I'm gonna draw a curved line in and a curved line in and a line right down the middle and that's gonna be a leaf. And I'm gonna put one on the other side of his head and you can draw these leaves anywhere. And also he has in some parts like little branches so just a little rectangle and then off of that little rectangle we can draw another leaf and I think I'm gonna put one more down here a little branch with a leaf perfect and there's our Groot he looks awesome all right, now let's color. Our Groot looks so good. Thank you for drawing with me and I'll see you next time.